news. Some regional chairpersons of the People's National Convention, PNC, constituting themselves as the party's National Executive Committee, have removed from office the leader of the party, David Apasera, and National Chairperson, Moses Daniba, for misconduct. According to the group, the meeting held on August 28 to suspend the General Secretary, Jeanette Nabila, is null and void since quorum was not formed per Article 45, Law 3 of the party's constitution. Tuesday's announcement will be another twist in what seems to be an unending political wrangling within the PNC. Some regional chairpersons constituting themselves as the party's extraordinary National Executive Council have declared the party's 2020 presidential candidate and national chairman suspended. Mr. David Apasar and Moses Daniba are guilty of the accusations in the petition that they are removed from their respective offices pursuant to Article 49A4 of the PNC Constitution for misconducting themselves as prescribed in the petition indefinitely. We are saying that they are removed from office and they cannot carry themselves as officers of the party anymore. This is barely 24 hours after David Apasara swore in the Deputy National Youth Organizer, Prince Ejimandia, as Acting General Secretary in the presence of another group which says is the legitimate National Executive Council. I, I Prince Ejimandia, do solemnly swear to fulfill my duties, obligations, and to uphold the integrity of the High Office of the General Secretary and to uphold the integrity of the High Office of the High Office of the General Secretary to the best of my ability. To the best of my ability. But the Ashanti Regional Secretary of the party, Suleiman Asedu, says the newly appointed General Secretary cannot hold himself up as such. They have cited the two leaders, David Apasara and Moses Daniba, as misconducting themselves. That in their absence, the Greater Accra Regional Chairman shall act as the National Chairman and Leader of the PNC. Balame Kankang shall act as the Chairman and Leader of the PNC until further notice. That the General Secretary is cleared to continue to conduct a function as stated in the Constitution, and she, together with the acting National Chairman, should see to it that David Afasara and the former chairman, Moses Daniba, should not carry themselves as said. They should hand over all the party belongings to the office of the general secretary of the party. The latest development would be the widening gap and worst turn of events of one of Ghana's minority parties, which in the early days of its glory years held a few seats in parliament.